<laughs> Thank you guys so much for coming. It's so good to see Except you. This. Get to finally meet you. I'm so excited. <laughs> Lola Palooza 2020. Right outside of Dallas, Texas. Okay, here we are. RV Rebel Girls camp out. Spot 68. Just out here enjoying a great day, enjoying the dogs. Taking the dogs out for a walk. Crafty Oki. <laughs> oh yeah. So what we're doing, we're having a cook-off where they can come down and bring in one of their favorite dishes and everybody's going to vote on what they think is the best. Of course, Lola's sitting right over there. She says, hey. Kim's over there just a talking. There's Vicky. There's Eric. So it's a good little open gathering here. Dana's up there with Full Tiny House right there. So there's a bunch of different people down here. We're just having a great time. The weather has changed. The rain came in last night. We survived it. There's RV Rebel Girl. People just coming in. You gotta come in and taste test and vote. Great gathering. Everybody's kind of social distancing. Of course, most of us nomads have been separated from the general public for a long time. So here they come. Here come some more people in. The nomadic ramblers, Sharon and Mr. Childers. Everybody's looking at the e-bikes. I think the e-bikes is going to be one of the biggest selling things going on. A lot of people are getting them. First annual Lola cook-off, taste testing. It was a tie for first, and one vote different for third place. Oh, 
vote this in, they are announcing the winners. <laughs> Hey, Kathy, I just want you to know it was my vote that put you over. Oh, okay. There is a Well, the best way to get into finance is not finance. Yeah. Yeah, and, and I would, I suggest going straight to the show. They're saying that some people are talking about that. Right. 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 That, that are really there. Yeah. Guess they're made in China. Uh, electric's made right there. So they were saying they got those for eight hundred dollars. The little e-bikes. It's not too bad of a price. E-bikes are coming down. I like the seat. There is. Yeah. I bought the seat. That's not for me. I like it because their seat was pretty good, but I like that seat. More crazy YouTubers. Bees Outdoor Adventure YouTube channel. So I get Well, here we are at the end of Lola Palooza 2020. It was a great time. We met a lot of people. It was nice meeting everybody and putting a face to to their YouTube channels and everything. It was really it was nice. Yeah. So we are at spot 37. Well, we're with some bandits over there. We don't know who them people are, but don't, don't mind them. But anyway, coming to an end, we're going to try to head back to Louisiana to see family. For Thanksgiving. But here comes number five. <laughs> Louisiana has had trouble with their hurricanes this year. And now here comes what, Zeta? They calling it Zeta? Yeah, it looks like it's kind of moving a little bit now, so hopefully it'll continue moving. So anyway, we're going to try to go east as far as we can go. We we'll think we'll go across the top side through Mississippi and then see if we can drop down. But we want to stay away from the storm surge. And uh, it's just going to be what it's going to be. But uh, we're not too worried about it. We've been through them before. We'll make through it this one, hopefully. Um, Bentley's doing good. He's inside playing. And uh, so what do you think of Lola Palooza? Well, like I said, I thought it was nice just to put a face with, with everybody. And everybody was super friendly, super nice. Yep. It was a great time. A lot of big time YouTubers here. Again, Lola, thank you for all your efforts of putting it in. It was a great time. And, and Vic, Vicky Van Gogh, yes. we appreciate your efforts. <laughs> and everybody. everybody else that cooked. <laughs> it was a great all around. People were social distancing, staying away from each other. Yeah. Uh, if you felt like you had issues, but man, it was no big ding. We've been doing it for what, nine months now? Yeah. Since uh, February of this year. And here it is in uh, almost the first of November. But anyway, we're gonna set off in the morning. It's kind of rain coming back in. When we got here, it was almost 90 degrees. It rained one night, turned cold, but. Man, that's in the south in Texas. You just got to go with these weather fronts. But uh, we're going to head off in the morning, but we thought we'd uh, show you a little bit of the spot here. This is Cedar Hills Campground, and it is a really State a great Park. campground. Yeah, Cedar Hills State Park, uh, south of uh, I-20 on the south side of Dallas. But uh, they got excellent camp spots, 50 amp service. Uh, they got areas you can tent in. But we have 30 amp service, don't we? Yes, you have 30 amp, but they have 50 amp service in some areas. Okay. But we don't need 50 amp. But uh, there's people still coming in and going here. And uh, we fix to be going tomorrow morning. We're going to pull out. In fact, we're going to a, a place that we've talked about many times and never went. Bucky's! Here we come, baby! <laughs> I've been. Daryl's never been to a Bucky's, so he's going to go with, with Bobby to a Bucky's tomorrow. That's right. We may not ever get out of there. We might just set up camp there. <laughs> From what I hear, it's supposed to be good. But anyway, stop the madness. Start the adventure, guys. We're going down the road. Some days here. See you down the road. <laughs> <laughs>